feeling wiped out after a simple grocery run, and wondering why even clean eating leaves you foggy. Welcome to Dr. Mercola's Cellular Wisdom. Stay informed with quick, easy to listen summaries of our latest articles, perfect for when you're on the go. No reading required. Subscribe for free at mercola.com for the latest health insights. Hello, and welcome to Dr. Mercola's Cellular Wisdom. Today we're looking at reductive stress, the hidden energy backlog that stalls your mitochondria long before lab work flags disease. I'm Ethan Foster. And if chronic fatigue or brain fog shadow your days despite meticulous habits, this episode explains why your cellular engines may be jammed rather than worn out. I'm Alara Skye, and together we'll unpack how excess electron donors like NADH silently clog energy flow, how high-fat or high-carb plans can backfire, and which targeted steps restore metabolic flexibility. Think of your mitochondria as an assembly line. Glucose or fatty acids arrive electrons pass down a chain, and adenosine triphosphate, ATP, rolls off the end. When you oversupply fuel, the conveyor belt stalls. Electrons leak backward, pressure rises, and superoxide radicals batter DNA, proteins, and membranes from within. You sense this before routine tests do. A rising NADH to NAD plus ratio quietly slows every repair pathway you rely on to burn fat, balance sugar, and recover from stress. Fatigue, sluggish thinking, and poor exercise tolerance are the early clues that your cells are drowning in their own resources. Overeating alone creates the jam, but pairing it with vegetable oils rich in linoleic acid turns a slowdown into gridlock. Those oils wedge into mitochondrial membranes, stiffen them, and worsen reverse electron flow, pushing oxidative byproducts even higher. Reverse electron transport is the red flag moment. Electrons retreat through complex Y instead of moving forward, triggering a burst of superoxide that smashes mitochondrial DNA like shrapnel. Energy production falls, damage escalates, and the cycle feeds on itself. Researchers describe a two-phase spiral. First, surplus NADH and FADH2 pile up. Second, Leaked radicals spread inflammation that sabotages insulin signaling and liver fat handling. Left unchecked, reductive stress morphs into type 2 diabetes, fatty liver, and memory decline. Standard panels miss this, but specific ratios expose it. Lactate to pyruvate shows how backed up glycolysis is. Beta-hydroxybutyrate, acetoacetate, reveals liver redox status. Malate.oxalo, acetate, and alpha ketoglutarate. Dot glutamate flag TCA cycle stalls. When these numbers climb, your mitochondria are waving a surrender flag. Modern life adds accelerant, processed foods, endocrine disrupting plastics, and long hours sitting all keep fuel high and demand low. The result is an electron traffic jam that becomes your new normal until you act. First, Eliminate vegetable oils and common endocrine disruptors. Swap soybean, canola, safflower, sunflower, and grapeseed oils for ghee, grass-fed butter, or beef tallow. Replace plastic food containers and heavily fragranced personal care items to reduce BPA and phthalate exposure that worsens insulin resistance. Second, introduce low-dose niacinamide, 50 mg three times daily. This simple B vitamin raises NAD+, and helps enzymes clear the NADH surplus that blocks energy flow. It is inexpensive, widely available, and well-tolerated when taken with meals. Third, avoid extreme macros. Both strict keto and chronic low-fat can overload mitochondria if overall fuel exceeds demand. Most people regain energy balance around 250 grams of carbohydrates daily, centered on ripe fruit and white rice once oils are removed. Adjust slowly and monitor how you feel. Fourth, request the right tests. Ask your practitioner to measure lactate to pyruvate, beta-hydroxybutyrate to acetoacetate, and fasting insulin alongside glucose. A HOMA IR score drifting upward, or redox ratios above reference ranges, signals that your cells remain in traffic. Fifth, move, but gently. A 30-minute walk or light body weight routine pulls electrons through the transport chain without adding oxidative burden. As capacity returns, layer in brief strength sessions. The goal is consistent demand, not exhaustion. 
Restoring flow does more than lift fatigue. Balanced redox states revive antioxidant recycling, tame inflammation, and sharpen cognition. When NAD plus rises and electron pressure falls, ATP output climbs and daily stressors bounce off instead of beating you down. Over the next seven days, choose one concrete step. Purge vegetable oils from your pantry, begin low-dose niacinamide, or schedule those redox ratio tests. Notice how quickly even a single change can lighten the mental and physical drag you thought was inevitable. Thank you for watching Dr. Mercola's Cellular Wisdom. We'll see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching. Subscribe now and click the notification bell so you never miss an update. See you in the next video.